Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Right after Texas school shooting, CNN does what they do best. CNN didn't waste any time in producing what many say is fake news. Not long after Friday's school shooting at Santa Fe High School in Texas, they reported some false information. CNN chief national security correspondent Jim Shuto and political correspondent Sarah Murray both tweeted that Friday's deadly shooting brings the total number of U.S. school shootings this year to 22. The problem with these numbers is that CNN and some other news outlets' stats are significantly exaggerated. They lump in accidental firearm discharges, domestic disputes, and events that don't involve students with the active shooter. These are all situations that most people don't lump into the specific category of school shootings. The list that CNN is using even includes an incident in Alabama where one person was injured at an campus apartment building. There was another shooting at Savannah State University in Georgia that is counted despite even though the two people involved were not students. A number of media outlets take their total numbers from every town for gun safety. It is a non-profit gun control advocacy group. Their statistics include any time a firearm discharges a live round inside a school building or on a school campus or grounds. Their current count is even higher than CNN's. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.